Yo, what is up YouTube? This is Anthony Wachiller here today, bringing you guys another unboxing. In today's video, I'm going to be unboxing the Jordan 6 Retro Carmine 2021. Here is the OG box. This is a size 11.5, and the color is white, carmine black. This pair first released in 1991, then re-released again in 2008 for the countdown pack, and then again in 2014, and then about six years later, it released today, February 13th. And uh, this pair is identical to the first one of the 1991, which is pretty cool. Before we get into this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for 725 subscribers. It means a lot. And let's get right into this video. So here we have the shoes. This is the men's pair, and this is a grade school size 7 and size 11.5. Pretty awesome shoe. Retailing at 140, about 148, 40 after tax, and 200, 212 after tax. I picked these pairs up. As reservations and the other one this one was a first come first serve at a store near me pretty happy to pick these up and uh og shoe got the nike air on the back got the synthetic red leather material across the whole whole shoe what's funny is for this release they had like a manufacturer area and like the midsoles if it's like a light toned pink kind of like compared to the top leather it's kind of hard to see i was lucky enough to like pick through the pairs at the store before uh, I paid for them. There's a lot of other ones that were like actually pink, which was like, I, I didn't want to pay for that price, you know, at that point. So I, I would have passed on them, but I was lucky enough to pick up this pair. It's pretty, it's pretty good. I think this pair is like one of the better ones. So it's pretty cool, pretty good shoe. Got that Jumpman. It's like a Hirachi kind of tongue of the feel. A little bit different than the other shoe. Got white laces. This is the only laces of the shoe. Um, you got a rubber tongue and a rubber heel tab. This is a pretty good shoe. Got icy bottoms. You guys got to let me know in the comments if your pairs came like this. If you had a GS and a men's pair, it's weird because this one's like blue icy bottoms. And this one's kind of like, if you see the difference, it's like more minty ice. And this is blue. I think I talked to another friend of mine. He had the same issue. I think that's just manufacturer. But overall, pretty cool shoe. I kind of like the blue on the bottoms if you look closely. Yeah, it's pretty noticeable right there, but uh, pretty cool shoe. And overall, it's pretty uh, pretty solid, sturdy, and it'll take a few wears to break them in. It is pretty thick, and uh, the shoe does run true to size, so get your normal size for a Jordan 6. And yeah, you got your air bubbles on both sides, midsole, icy. And there was a very high demand and supply for this shoe. A lot of people were picking up these pairs, and there's a lot of pairs on the market from past releases of years. So that means resale is pretty good right now, right around 280 the 320 making profit for resellers or anyone that wants to sell them, right around $100 profit. If you sell local or to anyone, if you sell like StockX and go a little bit lower, but still you're making really good money on this release. I did myself, I sold six pairs, pretty happy about that, made a couple of dollars profit. These Jordan 6 Carmines were the first big release of February 2021. Next week, we got Dunks, Yeezys, and Jordan 1s. I'll be focusing on those Silver Toe Woman Jordan 1s and a bunch of other Dunks. We got lots of colorways of those. Lots of ones. Those UNC Dunk Lows are pretty awesome on my eye. And yeah, so thank you all so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for 725 subscribers. And hit that subscribe button and like button if you enjoyed my shoe content. Got lots of unboxings, reviews. Old predictions, everything shoe related, subscribe and I got you guys. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.